Hello, I'm Dr. Elsa Cartanas Hagen, and I'm here to answer some questions that you may have in helping your child learn to read. Here's a question. I am still learning English, so how can I help my child learn to read? Excellent question. Did you know if a child can read in their home language, otherwise known as the native language, whatever you speak in your home, that is very helpful for learning to read in English. So here's some suggestions. This is what we also wanna see when you're in your home. I need your home to be a language rich home and a literacy rich home. Gosh, what does that mean? A language rich home and a literacy rich home. Well, a language rich home means that everything that you do, you're attaching language to it. You're describing everything that you do. For example, um, if I were baking, which I love to do, uh, and I were wanting to make a cake and I had my child with me, I would be saying something like, now we're going to get out the flour. We need some sugar and eggs. What will we do next? We will put that flour and we'll crack those eggs and mix to make a batter. So the child is listening, repeating, and then retelling to me exactly what we did. So, you know, there's so much language opportunity in our home that's natural. That's what we want for our children, to have these natural opportunities. The more language that your child has, the more vocabulary that they have, the better off they're going to be for learning to read. We want to expand their vocabulary so that they can get to reading and reading comprehension. One other thing that you can do to help your child is tell stories. Storytelling, it's a wonderful activity. Tell your child stories about your own life and that of your ancestors, your parents, your grandparents. Provide time for your child to have the opportunity to listen to the stories and then retell those stories so that they're learning about their language and their culture uh, and all about their own history. That provides them with a great opportunity for learning language and also world knowledge about their history. But now let's talk about making a literacy rich home. You can you find books in your home that you can read to your child or can you get online and read maybe go to YouTube and have them listen to stories and then also be able to retell them. What's really wonderful about that is then you can make sure that they're actually hearing the English language with precision. Uh, and so try to find that same book maybe in the native language as well, because you want your child to be bilingual and biliterate. The main thing is making this a routine. Maybe I'm doing the, the reading to my child in the afternoon when they get home, or maybe it's right before bedtime. Um, but this is what I tell families. Please, families, dedicate 20 minutes a day uh, to either read to your child or your child reads to you. That would be my great recommendation for today. For more information about teaching reading, please visit www.readingrockets.org. Reading SOS is produced through a partnership of the National Education Association and WETA.